you so much to the members of this channel. If you would like to become a member yourself, all you have to do is click the join button next to the subscribe button. Hey guys, button. welcome back to the channel. So before we get into this, I'm going to put the comment of the day up. If you guys want to take part in that, all you have to do is leave a comment and I randomly choose one for my new notifications. Also, before we get into this, I want to welcome the new member to the channel. Thank you so much for your membership. I always appreciate when you guys join my memberships. If you are interested in joining, all you have to do is click the join button. I have three different tiers that you guys can check out. I always appreciate when we have some new members to the channel, but we're going to get into the video today. We are playing Supernatural and we are about to have Faye's Bachelorette Party. I have her already at Varg's Tavern. Hopefully everybody is going to show up. It is going to start in a little bit. We got here a little bit early to make sure uh, that, you know, we got here on time because time was a little bit crunched for us. And um, yeah, so we're just hoping that everybody kind of shows up. We have a good time. I hopefully hope that we do. I hopefully hope that we have a good time, um, but we're just going to hang out. There's a cat here. So, oh my gosh, it's Sarah's cat. Uh, there's a cat here. So it has to be a good time. What are you doing? Who, who's taking your photo? Where, where are we going? I would not go to the back lot to have our photo taken by some strange person that we do not know. Well, she did it anyway. We came back here to get our photo taken, but we are going to go inside. She should be changing into her um, bachelorette outfit at some point, but I'm going to have her just come over here and order a drink. Let's go ahead and get the party popper because we are hoping that this party is popping or bopping, whatever, whatever they say in the Sims, but we're going to go ahead and get a drink. Actually, she might be changing into her bachelorette outfit. I'm not sure why she's just standing here staring into the, are we, are we going to go or there you go. Okay. She was changing into her bachelorette outfit, which I am so glad that she did. And it looks like we have some Sims coming in here. I hope that Sarah arrives. I hope that, you know, most of the people, okay, so we have Sims coming now, so I think we will be okay. Um, girl, no, do not, do not do this. We are not having, oh my God, is every going, everybody going to be attracted to our future husband? It does seem that is so, but we're going to get a drink and maybe we can get someone to ask for a toast or have her ask someone for a toast and also... Oh my God, everybody's attracted to him. Like, I get it. He's fine. Okay. Like he's fine, fine. But he's, he's also, he's also ours. So back off girls. All right. She's grabbing her drink and we're going to also, she wants to spray fizzy nectar at a sim. So we are definitely going to try that. I was hoping Sarah would be here. So maybe we could ask her to do the toast since she's like, Kind of our bestie. Oh my God, Sarah girl. No, we are not doing this. We are not doing this. Um, no, you paid for a drink and you walked away. I swear. Don't even like, do you see it? Look at her. She's like, yes, I did. <laughs> I'm such a goof. Well, since we lost our drink, we paid for it. I'm going to come over here anyways and just spray Miss Eliza here with fizzy and nectar. There's Sarah. I'm like, where the heck is Sarah? Is she pregnant? Maybe she's not. I just, it just looked like a pregnancy outfit, but I could be wrong. Um, let me, let me, let me, let me see what's going on here. Let me ask her about her day. I guess she's not pregnant. I just, for some reason, every time I see this dress, I assume that said Sim wearing it is pregnant. <laughs> Maybe she isn't, but I am going to also kind of just like, spray her with busy nectar and we're going to maybe, you know, there is some stuff upstairs, like over here that we can like gamble and stuff, but it looks like most of those machines are taken. Maybe we can come over here and sing karaoke. <gasps> She's having a bad day. I am too, because you're attracted to my man, but what, what are you having a bad day for? What, what has, what has happened that has made you have a bad day? We're going to brighten her day. Maybe that will lift her spirits a little bit. We're also going to spray her with this fizzy nectar. We're brightening her day. So I'm hoping we'll be able to, you know, make her day a bit better than it has been. I'm not sure what has happened, but, um, Ooh, Oh, something must have happened. Did somebody, did somebody die? Oh my gosh. Let me see. Where is she? She's right here. She's still married. So, Oh, okay. Oh, your friend said you needed a lifeguard on duty. So here I am party dancer time. Um, so Robin Banks, Robin Banks, 
is gonna be our party dancer. Oh my freaking goodness. Uh, let's see, what else can we do? Maybe we can fairy frolic with her and just have some fun because I kind of feel bad. I'm not, I'm not quite sure what's going on here, but, um, where, where, you're gonna, be, you're gonna dance over here. Okay, sometimes there's two sims that show up, but it looks like it's just going to be Mr. Robin Banks over here. Uh, if he can, you know, get his life together and actually do what he's supposed to be doing. Look at the dance moves. Wait, who are you? What is happening? Priscilla, what are you doing? Everybody's just, like, getting all up in his space, which is super awkward. But, okay, they're going to fairy frolic while Robin Banks does his little dancey dance over there. All right, they seem to have fun with that. Everybody's watching Robin Banks, but I am going to come over here. I was hoping that they can both play roulette, but I guess we can't really invite her. I mean, maybe we can, but let's come over here and sing with... Where is she? 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 There she is. Okay, Sarah, we are going to see if we can sing. Bubba has caught a termite. I am so glad for you, Bubba. <laughs> We're going to go sing with our bestie and then ask for a toast while everybody else is over here watching Robin Banks. And he's just... He should, poor Eliza, girl. I get it. I get it. <laughs> But we're going to come over here and sing karaoke with our bestie. Hopefully this has boosted her mood that she's like out with us. I just keep thinking she's pregnant for some reason. And I, I feel like I need to check because like, is she? Or is this just like literally being used for... Okay, it's just being used for a regular outfit. I just, every time I see this dress, I, I assume it's something else. But they are singing absolutely terribly. But this is so cute. Look at him go. Okay, the singing is pretty bad. <laughs> pretty bad, but we're just going to let them enjoy their time. I'm so glad she is here with us. I just, oh my gosh, I love them so much. Well, looks like everyone's having a safe time here. I think I might hang around for a minute or two. You do whatever you got to do, my dude. Look at them. Look at them. They're so cute. I can't even deal. Happy hour is over. Dang it, we didn't even get our drink from it. Dang it. We gotta get her a drink. They're like really getting into it now, which is killing me. Uh, but I'm gonna ask her to make a toast before she decides she wants to like run off because I really want her to make a toast. I feel like she would definitely be the best one for the situation. Why is there a kid in the bar? Oh my God, it's her son. Bobby Finley has just pissed himself while Robin Banks is standing here and she's okay. Did you bring she brought both she brought both of her children. Oh my gosh, what are you doing bringing your children to the bar? I mean really. I mean really, but whatever. We're just going to roll with it. Make a toast and please make it good. Um do you have bugs? What was that? Do you have bed bugs cuz um gross. <laughs> Let's see if she's going to, okay, I think she's going to, which means that we're going to have to make sure that he doesn't, yeah. Uh, oh, he's putting child in crib. Um, I don't want him to come here because for some reason it always, yeah, makes the other sim come here. Uh, but I need him to stay home with our baby because, uh, you know, oh God, he's in a terrible mood. He obviously was not taking good care of him, but I don't know what she's saying, but it seems like it's good. And she's like, yes. And now she's going to spray us with fizzy nectar. Here she goes. She said, don't you dare. Girl, yes. Girl, yes. I cannot imagine spending our bachelorette party with anyone else. I'm so happy that she has arrived. Our girl is super hungry. So let's get some food. Everything is so exciting expensive but let's get some shrimp cocktail because we're fancy tonight he's over here dancing our poor baby is going to crap his pants our pets are doing pretty okay bubba needs some food and some scratching but we are just gonna come over here and get ourselves some dinner take a photo with jane isn't jane the one who like took us out in the back lot and wanted a photo talk to odessa i did see odessa maybe we can say hi to her because we've kind of honestly avoided everybody except for our best friend which whatever it's fine she's she's really the only important one here besides us but let's go ahead and have our shrimp cocktail and i'm gonna try to get her a drink i don't know what time this place closes 
but I feel like it's super soon. It's definitely super soon. It is at 3 a.m. So we're not even going to be able to get a drink. The one drink that we wanted, she tossed off to the side. So that is unfortunate. Um, let's go ahead and check the lunar horoscope because why not? It's right here. Then we're going to get, get kicked out of here really, really fast. But let's go ahead and just see if we can use this for a second. I don't know if she even knows what she's doing. She's like, yeah, Pisces, today the moon indicates a possibility of misfortune for Faye Bloom. I wish I wouldn't have done that now. Dang. Well, I guess the misfortune was that we didn't get our drink. We paid for it and we didn't even get a drink. That is misfortune. So it is actually Kieran's birthday and I will be aging him up. I kind of, because I really want them to have maybe a backdoor outdoor wedding on spooky day. So it's only Monday. I am considering even doing a bachelor party. Uh, Tutor Darren to, okay, sure. We could use some job performance. Um, I'm considering trying to make our backyard a spooky romantic type of situation for their wedding. Cause I feel like that would be really, really cute. I've seen a couple of lots, but I kind of think it would be better if we just kind of had it in our backyard. Uh, let me know what you guys think about that in the comments down below. But I also really want to maybe give him a bachelor party too, since we still have a few days before it is spooky day, but he's just kind of getting his mood up, trying to get everybody together. He doesn't work. She is about to be off work. I actually cheated her energy a little bit, and honestly, I might cheat it just a little bit more so she's not super exhausted, even though she was out really late. Uh, oh my gosh, wait, we got a promotion? <gasps> What level are we? We're at level eight? Okay, so we got 888 simoleons, 888. Ooh, okay. So she makes 122 simoleons per hour and works 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. So that is pretty exciting. I did not realize she was actually getting a promotion right now. So whenever we tutor the student, that's going to help us out. So we need to work on logic, lectures, and charisma. So we will definitely need to focus on that. <gasps> Look who came to visit us. Let's go ahead and give a hug. And let's see, Bubba is, oh, Bubba's coming to greet us too. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have to give Bubba a hug or a snug or something. Um, Can we not? Why not? I guess because of this, where we're standing. Come on, give, oh, look at Bubba. Look at how cute. Look at how cute. Um, let's go ahead and talk to Bubba and reinforcement. Let's go ahead and praise you for being neat because we love a neat pet. So hello, little Bubba. They love, they both came to greet us. They love us so much. I can't even deal. They're so adorable. Okay, there we go. And I think they are doing pretty good. He is doing pretty good. She is good. All right, let's get ourselves a birthday cake for a little man and age him right on up. And then uh, I guess, mm, yeah, I'm gonna have to put it right here. I hope that we can make this kind of work. We also need to work on our garden back here. I can already tell it probably needs to be fertilized. Yes, yeah, so we don't have much at all. Um, but let's go ahead and blow out the candles for Kieran and see what he looks like as a child. Oh my gosh, he's going to be the one blowing out the candles for him. For some reason, I expected her to be, but I guess it makes sense because he's kind of home during the day with him, so he has a better relationship. But look at those little fairy wings. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait until they're actually married. Like I genuinely cannot wait and then have like more kids and stuff. So this is going to be super cute. Uh, Waggles, you're, you're so precious, but you might be in the way. I hope you're not in the way. I think he's okay. Uh, so hopefully mama is coming over here. She is, and he's over here tearing up stuff. So let's go ahead and toot our horns. There she goes. He's like, what the heck? He's going to blow out his candles. There we go. Oh, look at, look at Waggles thinking about the werewolf in the room. How awkward. No, that's kind of funny though. All right, let's see, who is he going to look like? I mean, I think we already know, but <laughs> who is he gonna look like as a child? All these unroutable sims. I'm definitely gonna have to give him a makeover because I'm sure he's gonna grow up into some interesting outfits. What was that? What was that? Okay, here he goes. 
Here he goes. Okay, due to your excellent parenting, we get to choose a trait. So, Kieran is athletic, Rattuso, and vehicle enthusiast? I mean, that's sure, that's fine. That's, I mean, I really don't know if I've bothered with the vehicle enthusiast um, trait. So, <laughs> oh, Kieran, you precious little child. All right, I did a super quick makeover on him, and he is so freaking adorable. I can't even deal, but I'm sure they're going to all grab some cake over here and just kind of enjoy their night. Uh, she's not hungry. He's not hungry. He's really not hungry either, and I'm just probably going to put the cake away unless they're both... Yeah, we're not going to let them grab one because... You don't need to get like super filled on the cake, but I'm going to go ahead and put that away. And uh, I was thinking about having them maybe get a little romantic, just a little um, compliment of appearance and just be kind of sweet to one another, maybe hold hands. Um, but yeah, I think in the next part, I really, she wants to give a lecture so we can do that. I really want to give him a bachelor party because I feel like he also deserves to have a bit of a party with his friends. So let's go and use the potty. And I think he needs to actually use the bathroom and take a shower, which means I am going to have to get him a different bed to sleep in. So we will have to do that. And it looks like Waggles, what are we doing? Oh, okay. We're going to be shy kissed. Oh, what is Waggles doing? Waggles be brushed okay we're gonna just let them have a moment here but it looks like we're we're not gonna have a moment are we oh no they're gonna woohoo please just be a regular <gasps> why do they have to do this to me because see now this is going to mess up my spooky day wedding this is gonna mess up my spooky day wedding why why why, why, why? Okay, so, and it's her. Because from what I'm told, whoever yanks who in is the one who is, yeah. Okay. Uh, so I guess she's ready for another baby. We'll see if we hear the try for a baby sound. That's not exactly where I wanted to go with this, but here we are. Uh, you're gonna jump up onto the bed, but what you really need to do is probably go potty. Um... I don't think that you can quite yet. So maybe just come over here and chew because mom and dad are going to, oh, they're gonna, they're gonna drive our baby right here in the fairy house. So there's that. Um, but we definitely need to do something with this garden because it's getting out of hand. So I need to have her work on that. But they're going to try for a baby right here, right now. So Let's listen for the sound. I'm not really wanting them to have a baby right now because I really wanted to have a spooky day wedding, but this could be some unexpected situations here. So I guess we just have to listen and see. I don't know. I didn't hear anything. Oh my God, I did. <laughs> my spooky day wedding is probably not going to happen. I mean, I guess it could. But I don't know how the outfits are going to be. So, girl, I really hope that you're happy with yourself. Like, you did not need to do that. You did not need to do that, but you did. Um, yeah, so I am going to wrap it up right here. Where should we throw the party for Young Jay in the next part? Uh, also, leave baby names because thank you, Faye for that one. Uh, <laughs> let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Don't forget to leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn on your post notifications, all of that fun stuff. I love you all and I'll see you in the next oh video. Oh my gosh, Waggles is about to age up. We're going to have an elder dog. I was going to wrap it up. Well, I did wrap it up, but I wanted you to see him age up. He's just a little baby. <gasps> Waggles is now an elder and he has the whole little gray situation, which makes me really sad because now Bubba and Waggles both are elders. He's over here tooting his horn. He's like, yeah, whatever. Um, so yeah, we have an elder dog. I am sad, but oh, he's so cute.
cute. Okay, bye.